Two teens are on the run tonight. Police say they escaped after crashing a stolen car into a Middletown apartment on Friday. As Cassie Arsenault tells us, the teens are considered armed and dangerous for a crime they committed before the crash, and police say there may be more suspects involved. <laughs> It's a chase with speeds that are over 80 miles per hour, a tense three minutes, and it only ends because the driver loses control and barrels into this apartment building. Show me your hands! Show me your hands! The two suspects throw themselves out the window of the apartment and run for it. This building left in shambles. Miraculously, the two tenants inside weren't hurt. Now Franklin police are looking for two black males. One was wearing a white t-shirt and jeans and the other gray sweatpants. But there's more to this story than the dash camera shows. Right away, the one male, he said, there's someone in my bathroom. The officers had no idea that there was still someone in the apartment uh, from that vehicle. A girl who was in the car locked herself in the bathroom of the apartment. What her role is in all this isn't clear. She only gave up a street name for one of the suspects in the car. This all unraveled because the Franklin police spotted the stolen vehicle and attempted to pull them over. Oakwood police alerted them a stolen Hyundai Elantra was spotted at the scene of a crime earlier that day. A person was held at gunpoint and robbed. A shot was fired, but the victim wasn't hurt. If they're willing to fire upon a citizen walking on the street for a robbery, they're not going to think twice about shooting an officer. It's for that reason police didn't rush into the apartment sooner. Worried innocent bystanders may get caught in the crossfire. And police say these two suspects may not be the only people involved. If you watch the chase, there's a second vehicle. There's another vehicle in front of the car they're chasing. A gray or silver Lincoln Navigator is also fleeing from police at high speeds ahead of the Hyundai Elantra. Police weren't able to get a license plate. Franklin PD aren't stopping until they track these suspects down. And they have a message for anyone who comes to Franklin and commits a crime. A lot of agencies won't chase bad guys. You come to the city of Franklin and you commit a crime, whether in our city or outside of our city, and you run from us, we're, it's our job to find you, to catch you, and put you in jail as safely as possible. Cassie Arsenault, Local 12 News. If you know anything about the people involved in these crimes, you can call Detective Hatfield. The number is on your screen, 937-746-2882.